Hi guys, this is Mike from BigLoss from the product management team. And I'd like to talk a little bit about a new term that we're talking about here called SASE. So what is SASE? SASE is something that uh, is a term created by Gartner that is basically called a secure access service edge. And what it's all about is, is the convergence of many different things. And so from a cloud protection perspective, you have apps in the cloud and you need to secure them, right? But then from a networking perspective, you also have various different types of connectivity requirements, access control, segmentation, IPS, IDS, typically things like that, that are also coming together. And so what we're seeing here is this convergence of cloud security and network security that's combining the two things into this new product or solution set. So what the SASE solution provides is basically a way to protect your infrastructure, protect your SaaS apps, protect different types of accesses that are going on, be it to uh, sanctioned applications like a box or an Office 365, or something else that's different, like blocking gambling sites or acceptable use type policy controls or sites that are trying to host malware, things like that. So how are people typically providing the security for this? There's two different ways. One is a hybrid approach where you take and you have a, say it's a headquarters office right here, and uh, you also have users that of course are, are mobile. And so people will install boxes. So I'll install a firewall, let's say over here, and it's sitting on the network. And now my computers that are sitting inside of here and my users are going through this before they hit the cloud, right? And so what you're doing there is, is providing a point of presence that needs to be managed, uh, be it a virtual one or, or a physical firewall. And then a lot of times they're taking agents and backhauling the traffic here, which involves a lot of latency. And so you really don't want this latency and users kind of object to that, especially if they're road warriors that are always out, they don't always back, want to backhaul their traffic back through these uh, termination points. Also from an IT perspective, you have to manage them and, and whatnot. So what uh, Big Glass is doing instead is this new approach that uses a smart edge proxy that has an actual agent that does smart controls over here on the actual endpoint itself. So instead of having to backhaul traffic through a box, all the controls are actually taking place on this Big Glass controlled agent sitting on the laptop. So what that means is that if I take that laptop, I go inside of this headquarters office over here, and I do some work, then that smart edge laptop is still controlled by this BitGlass agent, and things are all secure regardless of where the user's at. They leave the enterprise and they go somewhere else, now they're at the, uh, the Starbucks or the airport or wherever they might be, and still that control is taking place uh, automatically on the device. And something like this wasn't really possible years ago. Uh, because of the, the slowness of computers, things have really evolved. And uh, a huge advantage of this and doing this on the actual endpoints themselves is the reduction of latency and the improvement of kind of pushing the perimeter out to the actual endpoints themselves. And so what we've done is combine the capability to do things like controls over all the SaaS apps that Casmi's have been doing for a long period of time, because being a leader, obviously, in the magic quadrant there and whatnot, I'm sure you've heard from us before, but then also combining some of these other web type controls for URL filtering, web filtering, threat prevention, uh, identity, all those things together into one. So combining all those things, the confluence of different technologies and vendors together uh, basically provides this, this sassy controls. And so if you come check out uh, more details on the website, we have uh, different information. We can give you some briefs if you'd like to from a demonstration perspective. Thank you.